Toronto is beautiful, it's clean, it's nice, and most importantly, it's one of my favorite food cities in the entire world. Here are three more Toronto restaurants you need to be eating at right now. This burger for Maddie Matheson is Toronto's best. Mm, oh my God. Maddie's Patty's Burger Club gives you the choice of a Maddie, which is a seven ounce burger, or a Patty, which is a smash burger. Both meat made with a AAA brisket and chuck. I went with a double Patty and added a pickled jalapeno mayo along with their fries. It's oozing cheese, it's oozing fat, it's oozing that jalapeno mayo. It's perfect bun, really high quality meat. Oh man, simple, delicious. Mm. It's perfect. This is the video that might get me banned. Um, yeah, that's exactly what you think it is. Members Only Waffle House has a line down a block always with people waiting for their waffles. Did they taste good? Well, actually, yeah. Uh, but you know that's not why people are here. They are excited to get a bite of both um, the male and uh, female parts uh, that are turned into waffles. I went with the Girls Gotta Eat Girls and ordered from their variety of flavors and toppings you get to choose from. Do these like fruity and sweet? Do white chocolate? Dark chocolate and caramel chocolate. It's an experience you won't forget. Oh. Does it taste like a normal dick? It's better. Be oh, it's better. Better than a normal Ten times better. I'd rather eat this than, I don't know. A top, man's dick. Top top <laughs> If you're in Toronto, you have to get the famous female bacon sandwich at Carousel Bakery. But last time I ordered wrong, so I went back to correct my mistakes. All right, so last time I apparently screwed up the order. I just got the female on its own, but Chef Jordan Dina was kind enough to give me his order called the Jordan. Uh, it's female bacon on a bun with eggs, horseradish, mayo, and ketchup. Honestly, what I love mm. most of that thing is the horseradish. It complements so well the salty fattiness of that female bacon and the sweetness of the mayo, really nice. I will say, while this bun is really nice and soft and good, I remember the bun being different last time, it being like absolutely blown away by the bun. Maybe I ordered it wrong again? Not bad, but I think I enjoyed that bun better. I don't know, but this is a hearty, like, this is a good like hangover breakfast situation, you know? Mm. 